Hi everyone. In today's video, I will teach you how to make this type of glass morphism effect in Adobe Photoshop. I have this black color background. First, create a circle with the help of ellipse tool. Change its color to white. Right click on it and open the blending options. Click on gradient overlay and use this gradient. I have these gradient presets saved. How to save these? I already uploaded a video on how to save your gradient preset, the link is in the description. And these gradients can be applied to anything in one click. Hold the Alt button copy this circle. and change the gradient on it. Follow my process. Select all the circles and press Ctrl plus G to group them. Now create a card shaped rectangle with the help of the rectangle tool. Bring it top in layers. Round rectangle corners a bit. Change fill to 0%. Right click on it and open the blending options. Add a gradient overlay. Make sure both the colors are white. One side opacity should be 70% and the other side should be 10%. Use these settings. and add a stroke. Use the same gradient for the stroke with a little bit of setting changes. Apply inner glow. Use these settings. And add a drop shadow on it. Use these settings. When it is done, hit OK. Right click on it and select Merge Group. Create a layer via copy of the Circle Merge layer. Hold the Control button and click on a card shape layer. Add layer mask. Hold the control button and click on a card shape layer. Add a layer mask on other layer. Press control plus I. Select the top layer and apply Gaussian blur to it. Add a glass filter on it from the filter gallery. Use these settings.
I have this car detail which I use on it. You can apply anything on it. And that's it. If there is any question, you can ask in the comment section. Make sure you head over to my YouTube channel. Where I upload graphic related tutorials. Thank you for watching.